only on two terrifying moments for a driver after he was grazed by a bullet during an apparent road rage incident. Thank you for joining us tonight. I'm Chris Gutierrez. And I'm Lauren Freeman. This is just the latest in a string of road rage shootings across our area. It happened around 9 o'clock last night on the East Loop near Clinton in East Houston. Our Bill Barajas spoke to that victim and is joining us with his story. Bill? Well, the man we spoke to says he's just thankful to be alive. His Toyota Camry, which you can see here, was riddled with bullets. The back window shot out, bullet holes all up and down the side of the vehicle. And this bullet here going through his headrest and grazing him in the shoulder. That's when the bullet uh, went through my uh, headrest and hit me in the shoulder. Lucky with a whole lot of help from up above. That's how Denzel Washington describes last night's encounter. His car, proof of that. I believe uh, I need to get uh, more in tune with uh, God, you know. Uh, this is uh, it's a, a life-changing experience. Washington says he's not sure why, but it started just off the East Loop on Houston's east side when he was at a stop sign. Uh, I seen his gun and him getting out the car. Once I seen his gun, I left. Uh, I fled, I hit the median, and I uh, kept on going. The suspect following closely behind while firing at least 10 bullets into his Camry. Eventually, Washington says the suspect rammed his car, forcing him to stall out. And that's when he got out of his car with his, uh, his gun pointed at me. That's when I'm not sure if the gun jammed or uh, he just ran out of bullets. Washington says the suspect took off. He credits witnesses for coming to his aid and says something has to be done about these road rage incidents. I didn't know it was that bad in Houston. Uh, uh, really, something has to be done. Uh, this is pretty terrible. And again, just another live look at Washington's vehicle. Incredible, he was not seriously injured. As for the suspect, Washington says he was driving a 2009 blue Chevy Impala with no rims. If you have any information, you're asked to call the Houston Police Department and report it immediately. Reporting live, Bill Barajas, KPRC, 2 News. Bill, we're just glad he's okay.